Hello guys, welcome back. Today I'm sitting here at my table with this brown cloth, tablecloth. It's with pink flowers. And it's the same tablecloth as in my old crafting video. So I wanted to do a new video with some crafting and like coloring and just sitting here talking to you just for a nice and relaxing little time together, okay? So I have some scissors. some crayons some glitter gel pens glitter glue it says So I have my pro markers. And some different papers. I have this nice book. I got it from my friend Natalie. Very cute. There, my daughter, she was doodling or painting or drawing in it. No, but she made a line here and all the way in the like whole book. That's what it is, but it's very cute. I paint some cute hearts and the name in Swedish of heart is 
hjärta i h j e r t o hjärta hjärta har And let's make a star, star. Star, 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 star. And the name of star is Stjärna. J E R N A stjärna S T A R stjärna star Valentine's Day card. I have some color papers here and I want to, I want to have some hearts in red so I will do take a red paper and I will draw some hearts and I will cut them out so I will take a pen pencil and I think I I think I'm going to use this and I'm going to make the hearts in different size sizes So we have one heart. Let's do some more and some bigger, bigger ones. That's nice. And let's see here. We have another one here, a bigger one. That's nice. Uh, one more, one more uh, in that size. That's good. Okay, so first I'm going to cut off a bit of the paper. Like so. And I will do that.
one heart. I know a thing. I'm going to get a glass container and I will do a letter too. I saw on an Instagram channel. I have one that I follow. She makes a lot of crafting. She do all so cute stuff. And I got an idea to make a, a candle holder from an old glass jar. And then she had hearts cut out in pink and red and it's so nice to, to it's very nice to mix red and pink I think my daughter she really likes to craft and paint and draw and color. That was a cute little heart. Oh my god, it's a cat outside my window and I don't know who it, whose cat that is. Hello kitty. Kitty 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 kitty. I will show you the cat. Hello cat. Hello cat. Oh, it looked like my old cat, Felix, almost. I really, I really miss him so much. He was, I would, I think he was like 18 here when he passed away. He was sick, he was old. So we had to, we had to, Go to the wet. And what do you say? Put him, put him down. So I'm going to do some, some more uh, red hearts. And then I will do some of that pink and then we are going to get the and get the glass jar. There's a pen. So I have seen a lot of videos now on YouTube where people decorate for uh, not Christmas, uh, decorate for Valentine's Day, like instead of decorating for Easter or Christmas, they decorate they decorate for Valentine. I don't do that, but I think it's nice to like do crafts, but you can do things in your home that is uh, in that theme so maybe you can have red I have red blankets for Christmas maybe I could take them and put them in the couch again you can have um, uh, another tablecloth this maybe is a romantic one. <laughs> no, it's not so Valentine Day ish, but and I like that the hearts it's not so perfect. Like my you can see that your you have been cutting them out by yourself and I think that's nice doesn't have to be perfect 
It's like the theme of my channel. It's not... Nothing is perfect. Okay, one more. And I'm going to glue these hearts with a glitter glue, I think, because it will be nice to the glass. And let's put this away so it doesn't look so messy. And now we have the red hearts and some pink hearts. So, instead of making a valentine's card, I will make a valentine's candle. Okay. really focus now if you hear and you don't hear me talk as much but that's nice too we don't have to talk all the time you know we can just sit here maybe you also can be doing some crafts or maybe you have a nice rest in your couch or in your bed maybe you are about to go to sleep and maybe you have some anxiety and I, I hope you can find peace in this video because you don't have to be and feel alone because I'm here with you and there's nothing to be afraid of and everything is going to be all right and now we are going to heading to lighter brighter times I'm going to get the gloss okay, jar so I could only find this one it's quite small but uh, it's an old like jar from a taco salsa or something and also I got a candle here And now we are just going to attach 
attach the hearts with uh, the glue and we use this red glitter glue and this pink one and we are just going to glue them up And also maybe I could put some over for nice uh, effect. Oh, was too much. I move it around so I can like spread the glue. And yeah. Oh my god, this is so cute. I think my daughter will like to do this also but I need to find some more uh, empty glass jars maybe we can go ask for some glass at my uh, my do you say uh, the kid's grandfather? It looks so nice. So it was. Uh, a bit easier to use your fingers and press out the glue and put it over also and it will take a while for it to dry but I think it will be very nice So you press out the heart and it will come some extra glue on the side so you can put it on over the top of the heart. The last pink heart I think. Yes. It doesn't... It, um, if you have some extra glitter, it doesn't... Uh, it's okay because it's nice when the light is... the candle is lightened. And now we are going to put the the red hearts Oh I don't know if I want to have that big one. So 
so please uh, hit the the thumbs up if you like this video it will be very nice because I saw that you really like my old crafting video so this is why I make a new one because it's very relaxing to craft you do something not having your phone in your hand all the time or watching a TV this is something that feels very relaxing to do and I hope you like it Maybe one more red here. Okay, so look at cute. I think I'm happy with this, and now it looks quite like messy but I think it would be nice nice uh, after when it's dried so I'm done and I'm very happy I think it's very cute and romantic so if you also made one please comment and tell me how your lantern or candle holder turn out and thank you for watching this video I will see you soon in my next video. Goodbye!